So what do you need for Ace? Well, uh, Trina and I are going to go to New York for a little weekend getaway. That sounds fun. Yeah, yeah, it will be. And I was just wondering if you wouldn't mind keeping an eye on Esme and Ace. I have been keeping an eye on Esme and Ace. And she seems to be doing well with him. Reasonably well as a receptionist. Aside from the obvious, why do you think she needs to be supervised? Well, we all know the new and improved Esme. The one that surfaced after claiming that she had no memory of anything that happened before she washed up on the Haunted Star. But let's not forget all of the awful things that she did before that. I won't. But whether she's faking her memory loss or not, you have to admit, She's good with Ace. She is. But she's attempted to run away before, and now with my grandmother and Kevin out of the country looking for my father, I would just feel a lot better knowing that Ace was safe. Oh, um... Sorry, I forgot to get you this, um, payroll at it, Alexis. Thank you. The payroll wouldn't have gone out in time, and I'd have a lot of staff members breathing down my neck. Uh, sorry, I forgot it earlier, but if I get it to accounting now, I can uh, make it before the deadline. Thank you. I appreciate it. And so will the staff when their direct deposits hit at the end of the week. Better get it to accounting. Well, thank you, Aunt Alexis, not only for your legal advice, but also for agreeing to check in on Esme and Ace while Trina and I are away. We're family. That's what we do for each other. Just a thought, but Esme is family too, so if you could trust her first, maybe she would be a little well, more trustworthy. That might be difficult. You have to admit she cares about that little boy. Look, I feel the same way about Ace that Esme does. Good. You have that in common. Love for that little boy. Let that be the thing that brings you together instead of the thing that tears you apart. Just a thought again, let's go. 